Welcome back everybody. Time now for Fitness Friday. Yes, and joining us this afternoon, health and performance coach Garrett Stengel from Balance Fitness in Whitefish Bay. Here to help us determine what's the best time to get your workout How on. about right now? How about right now? If, <laughs> well, none of us are dressed for it right now, <laughs> no, but... Um, the, the, that's it's the age-old question, right? Most of the people that I that I come in contact with, most of the United States population is not getting it done. Yeah. So, um, you know, I actually pulled this uh, from a resource here recently, when ah. uh, by Daniel Pink talks about when the timing of everything. Okay. Um, and one of them is workouts. So workouts, ideally AM. If you're somebody who's looking to build routine, if you're looking to do fat loss. Oh, really? Um, <laughs> is that my only option in the morning? No, no, it okay. is not. Um, on the PM side, it's if you're looking for performance, if you're looking for increased um, injury prevention. Um, I'm in the first group, but I don't want to wake up. If, if you have a hard job and you're coming home from work exhausted, I would imagine the end of the day is probably not the time you'd want to work out. Probably the worst chance. Oh. Yeah, so for, for that situation, I either say try and get it in in the morning, okay. whether that's your chronotype or not, mm -hmm. or get it right at the end of your day before mm -hmm. you've gone home. Because once you go home, the camera will suck you in, it's yeah. over. <laughs> hmm. Okay, so we work out. If we want to lose weight, we got to do it in the morning. It's just better it's, in the morning. Oh, it's just better. It's just I like better. that. You're going to burn more fat in the morning because you're on a fasted stomach. You've got okay, no blood sugar sense. to work on. But um, at night, though, sometimes, I mean, like he said, you have a stressful job. Right. It's yeah. a stress reliever. I can't lose a little pounds doing it either. You, and, you, and, you ab <laughs> and you absolutely can. Okay. Most pounds are going to be dealt with through nutrition. Yeah, right. um, exercise is going to cause you to burn a few more calories, and then it's going to make you hungry for a few extra calories. Right. And so you end up being about a wash. Mm. Um, so the reality is if we're dealing with energy and stress relief, put it in wherever it fits in. Um, you know, and I do recommend just don't get to the couch before you try and get your workout in. <laughs> But squeezing it in where you can. I mean, doing but squeezing it in where you can. Timing can make a bit of a difference, but you actually have to put the time in somewhere in your day. Absolutely. That's step one. And you we're just do with, it. Yeah, and we're working with companies right now. How do you figure out, how do you get it into the day during your work day? Mm -hmm. There's time sucks for us. There's places where we're losing time right. and energy. Mm -hmm. if, if we can identify some of those places and switch them with healthier habits, We'll save ourselves time. We'll get, get it on the done. schedule if we and treat it like an important thing that you wouldn't cancel mm. to squeeze Absolutely. something else in. Yep. Yep. I would just say, if we could just get a shower here, many people would probably <laughs> work out during their lunch break. Just putting it out there. Just putting it out there. And I'm willing to say, check your Facebooks, check your Instagram, check iOS 12. All of those things uh -huh. now quantify how much time you're spending on their apps. Uh -huh. you, you could can, be working you, out. You could find yeah. out just how much time is actually being lost. Good advice. Mm -hmm. Thank Thanks you. for coming in. Well, if you have a question for our expert, you know what to do. You can email them at asktheexpert at todaystmj4.com, or you can also call 967-5253.